Hello guys and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. In the last episode, if you don't remember, we went ahead and we did a lot of fun stuff. We hung out with Junpei for a bit. We raised up our social stats a lot. We're now looking at charm number three. And in this episode, we're going to be hanging out with someone outside the school because no one inside the school wants to hang out with us. Uh, the reason that Yuko isn't here is because once we get closer to exams, all the people from clubs like Student Council President, as well as Chihiro, and Miyamoto and Yuko uh, just stop popping up because they're busy studying and the clubs are closed when we arrive closer to exams. So that's the reason that stuff like that is happening. It's almost time for exams. The third years are really smart, so we better score well if we don't want them to laugh at us. Huh, maybe I should study in the library. I get so tired when I study late at night. So, first of all, we have to hang out with Elizabeth for a second. Not hang out with her, but just go tell her that we finished a quest. Second of all, do we have a hermit or a hanged man social link? You're not hermit, uh, what's the one with the old people? Hierophant, or Hierophant, sorry, mispronounced it again. We don't have any of those, so we're gonna go have, we're gonna go ahead and make a new persona. So, all the more reason to head over to the Velvet Room. I see that you took on the Burger Establishment's eating challenge. I wasn't aware that completing it would grant you access to an off-menu combo. What a truly generous service. Though it has only made me yearn even more to challenge it myself one day. Please take this as your reward. Three whole Twilight Fragments. And... We're pretty much done with Overworld side quests because we just need to create a persona that's level three, 13 or above. And then... Hunt for more treasure and shadows. So how many have we completed so far? So we've completed 12 uh, side quests so far. I believe at 15 side quests we'll have unlocked something new. Let me guess you need my power right, the power of the Fairy King. Hello, Oberon. So there's actually an, an extra feature of the fusion mechanic. Oh, not this. Here's another, another uh, feature, is that sometimes when you create a persona, it'll have uh, an item that it, it, that it can give to you. But yeah, there's a whole other mechanic to this, and I actually have a funny story about my first playthrough of this game, but I need to wait because it only happens by chance. I can't show it off yet. All right, so we actually uh, helped out with a quest for Elizabeth because she wanted a persona that's 13 or higher. Oh, and we also fused Oberon by pure coincidence. I actually didn't expect that, so... There's another request completed. Got a female uniform. And, okay. Mithras. Sounds like I, I'm saying mistress, but with a lisp. Mithras. Okay, do I have a Koha spell card? Oh, do I actually... A moment, if you will. There's something I must inform you of. Whenever... Whenever you complete one of my many requests, I become ever curiouser about this world, and now have an urge to investigate this place for m and now, and now an urge to investigate this place for myself has arisen within me. Therefore, I'd like to request that you escort me to various locations. First, I would like you to guide me through the Polonia Mall here. If you have the time, then please come fetch me for s me so long as the sun is out. So yeah, we we can actually hang out with Elizabeth. It's not a full-on social link, but they are very fun uh, events. Uh, so let's go ahead and ask Elizabeth out. My, I've been, I've, I've been waiting for you to ask. Shall we be on our way? Oh my, an encounter with one of your world's exquisite treasures, right out of the blue. So this is the fountain. It makes sport of water, a precious resource, and the very foundation of life. Such a sinful form of art. I've heard of its mystical powers, wherein those who offer coin may have their wishes granted. Maybe so. Then I must try my hand at this. Fortunately, I anticipated this and brought a hefty sum of coin. 2,000 of your 500 yen coins, to be exact. I shall make an opening bid of 1 million yen. Oh! 
I was so caught up in the excitement that I started tossing coins without giving my wish any thought. This won't do. I shall give it more careful consideration before I return here in the near future. Hey Elizabeth, maybe you could toss some coins into my pocket or something? It would certainly help out with tartar stuff. Hmm? What is this facility here? I see there's a gentleman inside with quite the stern face. And these photographs displayed so prominently, most wanted. Reward? Hmm. Would it be correct to presume that these are your version of my subjugation requests? Pretty much. What do they use as proof that the target has been subjugated? If they truly parallel my requests, then do they require a piece of the body? My interest has been piqued. This edifice over here, is this what you call a club? Dancers dictated by the sway of one's inner passions. A subterranean garden flourishing with uninhibited desires. It's closed right now? Oh, what a pity. I had hoped to become part of the scene. Woo! <sighs> well, that was quite satisfying. But I'm overwhelmed. Everything looks so new and inviting. Everywhere I look, something catches the eye. If you don't mind, could you perhaps recommend our next activity? Let's go do karaoke. Karaoke? Oh, could it be? It appears the time has come to demonstrate my hidden talents. One may even challenge professional singers at the touch of a button at this karaoke. Uh, excuse me, would you mind waiting for a moment? I hadn't noticed there was a fountain on this side as well. Oh, yet another fountain. On the opposite side, I see. So this place plays host to a trinity of fountain spirits. I apologize for the wait. Let us continue. Now then, I shall perform a song of exultation for my master. Sing along if you will. La, la, la. Oh my, you've never heard this song before? That's a song that we'll get to a bit later. Experiences you've shared with me today. I consider this mission a complete success. This may sound forward, but I'd like for you to accompany me again sometime. Return to the Velvet Room with Elizabeth. So yeah, every now and then we could go ahead and hang out with her, and we get a funny new scene, and it also counts as another quest. Regarding the fountain, I still haven't decided what to wish for. Unfortunately, my master has vetoed my wish to renovate the Velvet Room with a dance floor. Could you imagine if that happened? I could never. Um, uh, I was so set on establishing Club Velvet that coming up with another wish has, has proved to be rather difficult. Oh! I'll wish to come up with a wish. There, that settles it. Please, take this as your reward. Small... Cheongsum. We can now fuse Hua Po. Neato. Anyways, so... Do I have... I was going to ask this question before I was interrupted by Elizabeth's date. Do I have a Koha Fusions... Like, card? I do not. I have Makoha... I don't know if that counts. I'll look it up later and see if Makoha counts or if it just has to be Koha. And what was that other one you wanted? Mithras? Are you accepting a request? Yes. I'll get around to that later. I mean, it's not like I'm one away from another date with you. I mean, we just went on a date, so... Let's get back to actually socializing with real people. Uh, I have a hanged man persona, right? 
Yeah, so I'll hang out with Maiko. Heh, <laughs> I'll hang out with Maiko. Nice. Oh, I forgot to read her text. I'm at the shrine, let's play together. Oh, hi, what are we going to play today? Okay, um, let's play on the slide first. My tummy's grumbling. Can we go to Wild Duck? The best response here is, sure, let's go. Okay, so here introduces uh, a running trend of Makoto Yuki having the chance to be an absolute douche to everyone he sees. Uh, newsflash for those who don't know, never say it's probably your fault to a child who's witnessing their parents' divorce. Uh, I'll just say... I don't know. I tried asking. He said it was a grown-up's problem. I don't want them to get a divorce! Mom and Dad was heavy! No, divorce is stupid! I hate it! <laughs> She's sobbing loudly. What should I do? Let's calm her down. Maiko's doing her best to smile. I feel like we're growing closer. I have to go home now. Thank you for playing with me today. After seeing Maiko home, I headed back to the dorm. Welcome back. Sup, dude? Uh, I'm so tired of studying. Hey, let's go to Tartarus. You should keep studying. Dude, you serious? Isn't saving the world more important? Hey, Yukatan, you must want to go too, right? You know exams are just a few days away, right? But I guess I could use a break from studying. Alright, I'll come too if you decide to go. We will not be going. We've pretty much done all we can do there. Uh, About that. So, get back to studying. I guess it's true that missing one day of studying probably won't change our results that much. Uh, am I really agreeing with Junpei's logic? Maybe I really do need a break. Oh, yeah. Nobody's gonna die if they skip a day of studying. Am I right or am I right? Anyway, times like these call for a change of pace. How do you feel about hitting up Tartarus? Let me think. Hey, not that you were thinking of pulling one or anything. But all-nighters are completely pointless. Whether it's training or studying, daily practice is what really provides results. So since we're going for courage again... Let's try out the normal stuff at Wild Duck, since I haven't shown that off yet, and plus it'll let me know if the mystery burger uh, helps out with um, with our stats in a decently helpful way. Decided to try the new burger. Staffer looked apologetically at me before turning away. <laughs> with some uneasiness, I managed to finish the whole thing. I've actually never seen that dialogue before. Oof, okay. Every time I always get into this mindset of like, okay, this time the social stats are gonna level up, uh, and then like, okay, I can feel it, next time it's gonna level up, and just get in a loop for the entire game. I can hear people talking. Hey, did you hear? hey I think our school might really be haunted. Uh, a friend of my senpai said that they heard a strange voice after school one day. Excuse me? No, don't tell me. I really can't handle ghost stories. Uh, I'm getting the chills. Maybe I should head to the nurse's office. No way, the nurse's office is that teacher's lair? Are you seriously going? He'll give you some weird medicine. I forgot to get the medicine from Edogawa again. The one time Edogawa is useful and I keep forgetting about him. Yeah, it's been like... It's been like three days. It's already worn off. Okay, next time for sure I'm gonna remember. God, does no one want to hang out with me? 
Got Chubby Student and Bunkichi and Mitsuko. Bunkichi and Mitsuko actually do lead to another social link, so it would be good to level them up a bit. Uh, I, I still think I'm on level 1 with them, or rank 1 rather, in the social stat department. Or rank 2! Huh, I, don't rem I didn't remember ranking them up any. I guess there was that one day that it was a weekend and I didn't really have anything else going on. Okay, so that makes sense. Do I have a Hierophant? Nope. Guess who's going directly back to the Velvet Room? I am Bereth. Fear not, my lord. I hereby swear loyalty to you and only you. Hehehe. <laughs> I really wish I had an odd morsel. Because you can only get it in Tartarus, because the point of the thing is that, you know, it's something that he's never eaten before, and he's pretty much eaten all of the food on Tatsumi Port Island, so... The only way that you'd be able to get a food that he hasn't tried is supernaturally. I'm not being mean-spirited, I'm just stating what the joke is. That's strange. I swear I left it around here. I don't see it anywhere. The best option here is to say, looking for something? Oh, how'd you know I was looking for something? Are you psychic? I'm looking for my glasses. I, I'm, uh, not my glasses, my, my wallet. I can't seem to find it. The best option here is to say, can I help? <laughs> Honestly, I do wonder if you can read mine. I was just thinking how nice it would be if someone lent us a hand over here. The three of us searched high and low for the missing wallet. We've searched everywhere, but wait, uh, what, what were we looking for again? Bonjour! I found something important on the ground outside. Does this belong to you? Oh, yes, that's it. I've been looking for this wallet everywhere. It may not be full of silver or gold, but this here is an even bigger treasure to me. Ah, excuse me. Are you not the transfer student everyone is talking about? I am one as well. I am a student at Gekukan. Nice to meet you. I am here from France as an exchange student. My name is André Laurent Jean Giroux, but you can call me Bebe. It's quite nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, again. I am delighted to, um, make your acquaintance. Yoroshiku! I train in the home economics room every day. If you get bored, come join me. Well then, au revoir and sayonara! My, my, what a classy young man. <sighs> I know I kept it in my wallet. I didn't want to forget about it at any cost. Ah, there it is. I knew I put it in here. Good going, me. Dear, that key, is it? Come on, dear, you know what it is. It's the key to our son's car. Such a nice boy coming to visit us has a way of making me feel young again. Been a while since I felt like putting the pedal to the metal. What age do I look, dear? Please don't. Why must you get into a car? Do you want me to end up all alone? What's this about a car? Oh, um, I'm sorry for raising my voice. Did I scare you? Uh, our son, uh, remember what I told you, uh, how he passed away? On his way home from work, he got into an accident. He was hit by a dump truck driver who was drunk on the job. I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, please punch me. Just punch me for being so insensitive. With all my excitement, I forgot to consider how my wife might feel. I'm such a... such a... Bunkichi-san shared the truth about their son's death. I feel like we're growing closer.
Huh? Uh, why are we all just moping around here? Since my wallet's been located, why don't we go out and have a nice dinner, dear? And this is for you. Consider it your reward for helping us look around. When Kichisan stuffed a medicine into my pocket. I parted with the elderly couple and went back to the dorm. Welcome back. Sup, dude? Hey, let's go to Tartarus. You could study anytime. We need to get stronger ASAP. Hermes here is itching to go ham. Go hit the books. Come on, give me a break, man. Well, Eeyore, you must be confident in your grades to be so insistent on not studying. Oh, uh, well, maybe I could just study just a little bit more. Gosh, a lot happened in this episode. We hung out with Elizabeth, Maiko, and the old couple, and we were also able to meet, uh, Bebe. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. In the next episode, we're gonna go ahead and continue, and I don't think we'll be able to start a new social link quite yet, but at the rate we've been going, we'll be able to work our way through tons of different social links. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!